I got it. The Rose Parade. Right around yes. the corner. Yes, for sure. And Gail Anderson is taking a look at all the preparations. Take a look at this. This is the float that's being constructed for the 2023 Rose Parade by the La Quinata, uh, uh Flood Ridge Rose Float Association. It's so big. There's a house on it and everything. Uh, this, I don't want to jinx it, might become an award-winning item for 2023. I say that because this is what happened in 2022. And check out this next float, which won the Crown City Innovator Trophy. La Kenyatta Flint Ridge Tournament of Roses Association has an answer to those who say you can't teach an old dog new tricks. <laughs> it's a pack of canines, young and old, who are learning new stunts at their local skate park. Their response is, who says we can? Gorgeous. Well, here's the illustration for what's happening out here now. I'm learning from uh, Ernest Copen. The name for this one is Secondhand Shenanigans. And uh, that sounds like fun. Y'all are famous for fun. Oh, yes, we are. But you're about life and fun with this one. Oh, yes. Secondhand Shenanigans, it's all about turning the corner in life. And what we have is our little character in the float who's graduating and moving on to the next step of life in this phase of, of forwardness. And what happens, all the toys are tossed out, everything is forgiven. and. Well, these rambunctious little raccoons come by and want to play with it. So what was not once someone else's trash is now someone else's glory and fun. And it's just shenanigans with the toys. Now, they're up early, not just because of us, but because of this. Take a look. The float is going to be foamed today. And this foaming will cover what I'm learning are uh, bed sheets. Bed sheets, that's right. Secondhand bed sheets. That's right. <laughs> indeed they are, indeed they are. So our superstructure is all made out of steel. Of course, the foam won't stick to the steel, so we sheet it with uh, bed sheets, and it gives a nice foundation and a good hard candy coating for a nice thick layer of foam. So we're gonna put, attach all those 13 different types of roses to it. There's a book that goes with this? There's a book that goes with this. My grandniece, my 13-year-old grandniece, wants to be an animator when she grows up. And so we arranged with her and her mother to do the float story in a children's book. The book's on Amazon.com yeah. and all the proceeds, all the royalties go to support the float. The second hand shenanigans of the La Quinata Flint Ridge Rose Parade Float Builders. In La Quinata Flint Ridge, Gail Anderson, KTLA 5 News.